What is going on, y'all? Travis here, back with another episode of Once Upon a Time, Season 3, Episode 11. Let's get into it, shall we? Never cease to amaze me, Peter. Outwitting the evil queen in less than a day? It's impressive. She loves the boy. That makes her weak. This is where we'll cast it. No ingredients? When it's done, will they all be dead? Worse, they'll be slaves to this new land we're making. With no idea who they once were, death is final, Felix. Their suffering will be eternal. Felix can kick rocks. Another curse. It's happening again. Is it gonna work like the last one? The last one was created to serve as the Queen's wishes. This will be done per Pan's desire. I'll be kind in something hellish. The curse was built to be unstoppable. There's nothing that can be done. Well, it is possible to stop it. What? By using the scroll itself. It can only be undone by the person who used the scroll. That's you, Regina. What she did is child's play compared to what I have in mind. I knew you'd win. Your ban never fails. What do I have to do? You must destroy the scroll. Both your curse and his shall be ended, but know this. There will be a price, a steep one. What do you suggest? Instead of going to him, bring him to us with a spell. One that will return Pan and Henry to their own bodies. Are we missing something? Yes. What is it? The heart of the thing I love most. You mean your son's heart, Rumpelstiltskin? No, I never love for Rumpel. Well, then whose heart do we need? They do we love. Love can mean many things, Felix. It doesn't just come from romance or family. It also come from loyalty, friendship. Oh, he about to get you! Only one person has always believed in Pan. That's me. Don't be afraid. Be flattered. No, 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 no! Ah! If I'm back in my own body, Damn, I'll have a scroll. Damn, Felix. Sucks, to, sucks to suck, bro. Sucks to suck. Oh, oh shit. Given the proper tone. The Black Fairy's one. One of the most powerful fairies that ever existed. Well versed in dark magic. The Blue Fairy exiled her, but before she did, she took her wand. I assume our dearly departed Mother Superior had it hidden at her residence. Well, let's hit the convent. Can I come? I should pay my respects to Blue after all. The rest Y'all are like button. the same I'm height. Sure. Other than Henry. Charming. Uh-uh. Fuck. Son of a biscuit-eating bulldog. What if it fails? A magic wardrobe? What do we do if this plan doesn't work? And the Queen's curse will transport us to a new land. We will lose our memories and become a slave to her darkest desires. So we have to have faith that your child will find a way to save us. How will she know what to do? One day, our story will reveal itself to her. You have to trust me. Our, our story, what does that mean? I don't know yet, but I do know that it will happen. Then how can you be so sure? Because I have the one thing you need now more than anything. Hope. Good luck, Snow. Have faith. That's easy to say when you have magic wings and a wand. Dude. This was supposed to be hers. Charming has become such a babe. I have hope we can prevail. This curse has destroyed every dream this family ever had. The unknown isn't always bad. Life is full of twists and turns. It's just a turn. But all I ever wanted was for us to raise our child together. That was our happy ending. The future we imagined is gone, but that doesn't mean we can't find another one, an unexpected one. I choose hope. I can believe. This mobile hung above your crib. I, it was supposed to hang over your crib. I like the unicorns. Giving you up when the curse hit was the hardest thing I've ever had to do. That is cute. I know. Every time I look at you, I wonder what would have happened if I hadn't had to. I do the same thing with Henry. You were doing your best. You were giving him his best chance. Yeah. But still, things would have been very different if I had kept him. We would have had a life together, a normal one back in Boston or someplace else. But I guess all that was just not meant to be. What's meant to be will be. You doing okay, kid? I'm just ready to be me again. Not much longer now, Henry. Not much longer. Once we have the wand, all will be as it should. We'll see. Sorry to interrupt, but we need your help. With what? Black Fairy's wand is here. We need it. It's a terrible, terrible thing. But what's coming is worse. Where is it? <sighs> How was that? And so. What does it want? The wand. Run. 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 Get the hell out of here. Stay covered. Over there. <sighs> Creep. Mr. Smee, you might want to pick up the pace. It would do our journey and your physique some good. It's just this place gives me the creeps. As it should. Do you think we should head back to the ship? Who was that? I found a way off this accursed island. We've dawdled here for too long. Now that I know there's a dagger can end the Dark One, we must return to our land. Can't your purpose be back at the ship where it's safe? Shit, scared me. It's me. <laughs> ah. Aren't you a little old to be a lost boy? 
I'm not part of Pan's brigade, and I can assure you I'm anything but a boy. Oh. Who are you, and why are you here? I'm the captain of the Jolly Roger, and I'm here looking for some magic to help me make my way back home to my land. You don't have any, do you? Magic? Fresh out. I don't buy that for a second. If I didn't know any better, I'd say you were a fairy. And if I didn't know any better, I'd say you were a pirate. Guilty. So tell me, fairy. The tension. Help you. Aren't you worried about me slitting your throat? Uh huh. Yeah. Well, that's not the fairy way. You should be helping me find my happy ending or something else. Is I'll precious. give you a happy. <laughs> I was a fairy a long time ago, but then my wings were taken away. As for your happy ending, you're on your own. Watch it. It's not a weapon, not in the traditional sense. Oh. Rum. Okay. What's so important back home? The dark one murdered the woman I love. I intend to make him suffer for it. And so killing him is your happy ending, even if by doing so you could end your own existence. I'd risk my life for two things, love and revenge. I lost the first. And if I die for my vengeance, then that's enough satisfaction for me. So all we have to do is light the candle again, right? Tension so between, between those yeah. two, the vibes. I'll draw a tire. I'm sure you want to do this. I thought you'd only risk your life for love or revenge. One other important thing, me. The mess you've got. Can you try it? Ah, it's too high. We gotta get closer. And I can't fly up there. Tink. If you didn't notice, I don't have my wings. You have a picture dust. Believe Tink. it does. You made it work once. You can do it again. Believe in it. Get in there. Ha! <laughs> ha! <laughs> Nice, nice. My shadow, bitch. Look who's still a fairy. Look who's still a pirate. You were right. Well, I lost a hand once. That's nothing. For the record, I know why you risked your life back there, and it wasn't for yourself or revenge. It was for Emma. Well done, Green. Blue. What? But you were gone. I know. But when you killed the shadow, mine was returned, and I was revived. Oh, well, that's nice. You finally believed in yourself, Green. Tinker Bell. Welcome back. I'm a fairy again, even after I disobeyed all your rules. You better be a fairy after bringing her <laughs> ass back. Really strict. You deserved your wings, Tinkerbell, and you have earned them back many times over. Thank you. As for the Black Fairy's wand, go. Save us all. That almost looked back. like a Harry Potter-esque wand. wand. Do we need anything else? Only one more item. I guess, like, how many... What is that? Uh, this is one of the you only can only make a wand look so many ways, I guess. Before they left for Neverland. It renders anyone with magic utterly powerless. I haven't forgotten about all that, by the way. <laughs> Mercy, you rest, Harry. I want to make sure that when my dear old dad wakes and he's weakened, this will block his powers. So what happens now? I enact the spell, and when you awake, you're back in your own body. And then you hang on to that scroll, and you come find us as fast as you can. I gave my heart to Pan. I thought I was being a hero. I'm sorry. Uh, you're not the one that needs to be sorry. Pan does. It's time. Pan's a hope. Keep your eye on the wand. Oh! What's happening? Henry's spirit is leaving Pan's body. It worked. Let's go find our son. You're not coming. My father and I have some uh, unfinished family business. Some, some other. Uh, uh, not, 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 not. Henry? You didn't turn in your homework again. Is there a problem? Oh, Henry, things really will change if you just believe it. Life is unpredictable. Is your life unpredictable? Because it seems to me like everything's pretty much the same around here. Except me. My birth mom didn't love me. Regina says she does, but she doesn't. I don't belong here. You do belong here, Henry. You are loved. I want to show you something. This morning, I was cleaning out my bedroom closet, like I've done every week, thousands of times. And do you know what happened? I found something. Something I've never noticed Every before. week? Clean out your closet every week? It was just there. Magic. That's not possible. Well, of course not, but it happened. This book somehow arrived. Was it given to me? Did I forget about it? I don't know, but there it was. And do you know what I saw when I looked inside? Hope. It looks like fairy tales to me. And what exactly do you think fairy tales are? They are a reminder that our lives will get better if we just hold on to hope. 
Your happy ending may not be what you expect, but that is what will make it so special. Can, can I borrow this? You can have it. Really? Believing in even the possibility of a happy ending is a powerful thing. I think you could use it. I'll see you in class. What a moment. Miss Blanchard. Yes? Thank you. Oh. You're very welcome. Emma. I've got his scent. He's nearby. The tower? Oh. It's me. It's me. It worked. Mom, Mama, I just saw you guys. You guys just saw me. But we didn't see you. I always got it. It's up to you now. Regina! Regina! Oh, hail to the gnaw. Hello, Papa. Fucking with Riri. -ri. Oh, you'd have killed me in my sleep, laddie. I guess you changed your... Oh, wait. I see. You've taken away my magic. That's why it's so easy for you to strut around and pose now, isn't it? I wanted to talk to you. Asshole. I wanted you to see me and think about what you've done. Of course. To look at my son here at the end and really see him and think about what might have been. Is that what you want? Because I do. I remember looking at you, the littlest babe. Helpless and all mine. Those big, big eyes just full of tears. Pulling at me. Pulling away my name, my money, my time. Pulling away any hope of making my life into something better for myself. This pink, naked, squirming little lava that wanted to eat my dreams alive and never stop. What are you now? A couple hundred? Can't I be free of you? No, oh, you will be. In death. Then one last lesson, son. Never make a cage you can't get out of. I made this cuff. Oh, shit. But on you. Down, boy. <laughs> Let's see how you do without magic. Now, see, when you fuck around, you gonna find out. Fuck I'm around and find out. For them. For your son. None. It's too late. Soon that fine green smoke will fill their lungs and fold their brains. Not like the rest of this town. I'm not just going to take their memories. Because of their special meaning to you, I'm going to take their lives. Nuh-uh. And you won't do a thing to stop me. Do you know why? Because without magic, you were right back to where you started. The village coward. Ooh. You're an asshole. <sighs> Hands an asshole. <sighs> We got Rumpy with no magic. Riri's knocked and out for the count. What Too the fuck? Years to count, babe, but I've counted everyone. I, I'm sorry. I, I didn't know you were in here. Go away. Oh. I'll, uh, I'll just put these flowers down. Go away. Dear God. Emma, I'm so sorry. How old would he be? Well, he's not dead. He's just lost. Lost? Those hands. Today is his birthday. I should be with him celebrating. We had a chance to be happy, and I was afraid. Maybe it's not too late. My ending shall not be a happy one. You about to cut your Regina. hand off? Regina! What happened? What is it? I saw what needed to be done. Are you going to be OK? The important thing is, you will be. No, he won't. Son of a bitch. He has the curse that I do. Look at uh -uh. you all, a captive audience. Uh-uh. I you like a pack of dolls, couldn't I? I think I'll start with these two. Hard to tell which one to kill first. Uh-uh. No, it isn't. You. You first. Stay away from them. Not so die. How about this? I'm not gonna let you touch either one of them. I'd like to see that. I'll have a job to finish. I have to do it, whatever it takes. And what needs to be done as a price. I'm finally willing to pay. I used the curse to find you, babe. To tell you I made a mistake. To make sure you had a chance at happiness. Just not with me. I accept that. Pretty, pretty words. I love you, babe. And I love you, pal. You made me stronger. Stronger? But still, no magic. Oh, but I don't need it. You may have lost your shadow, but there's one thing you're forgetting. So have I. I sent it away with something to hide. Oh. Uh, what are you doing? The only way for you to die uh, is if we uh, both die. Now, uh, I'm ready. Uh, no. Hello, Papa. You can stop this. No. You I said you did. You dagger. never even loved him. We can start over. We can have a happy ending. Nah. But I'm a villain, and villains don't get happy endings. 
Nah. -uh. Wait. No. Rumpel, he's, he's gone. Regina, are you okay? I'm fine. I'm so sorry. My father did what he had to do. Nah. -uh. He saved us. Regina, don't let him die for nothing. Regina. What? We have a reason, love. Pam? He's dead. This curse remains. Can you stop it? We all start preparing our souls, because mine's going to take some time. It's here! The curse is here! Grumpy is stop one it. of the best characters on the show. Is he really gone? So stop it, right? Yes. Gold said that there was a price. What is our price? It's not our price. It's mine. What are you talking about? It's what I felt when I first held it. I have to say goodbye to the thing I love most. Henry? I can never see him again. I have to undo what I started. The curse that brought us to Storybrooke. That created Storybrooke. It doesn't belong here. And neither do any of us. Breaking the curse destroys the town. It will wink out of existence as though it were never here. And everyone will go back to where they're from. Prevented from ever returning. He'll go back to the enchanted forest. Except Henry. He will stay here because he was born here. Alone? No. You will take him because you're the savior. You were created to break the curse. You can escape it. I don't want to. We'll both go back with everyone. Bitch. Not an option. I can't be with him. If I don't pay the price, none of this will work. Emma, you have to go. I just found you. And now it's time for you to leave us again. No, I'm not done. I'm the savior. I'm supposed to bring back all the happy endings. Look around you. You've touched the lives of everyone here. We're a family. And we always will be. You gave us that. You and Henry can be a family. You can be like everyone else. You can be happy. It's time for you to believe in yourself, Emma. It's time for you to find hope. I've known you for some time. All I've wanted was for you to get the hell out of my life so I can be with my son. I'm like, fucking Henry, what? What I want is for Henry to be happy. We have no choice. You have to go. Ah! Uh -uh. What? But what? But then what? Okay, now, big push, big push. <laughs> That's beautiful. It's a boy, Emma. <laughs> Emma, just so you know, you can't change your mind. I can't be a mother. This isn't fair. Y'all do it too it's much. You fault. gonna kill Rumpy and then you gonna fucking, <laughs> you gonna split up the whole town and you're gonna separate? Emma. I just lived under the curse with you. None of this would have ever happened. I thought you didn't love me, but I was wrong. I was wrong too. I cast a curse out of vengeance and I'm, I'm a villain. We aren't Mr. Gold. Villains don't get happy endings. You're not a villain. You're my mom. Yo, I'm sorry. Don't be. We gotta get our boy the hell out of here. We have to go back there. Yeah. This is like season finale shit. What are we doing? It's quite the vessel you captain this one. It's not a day we'll go by, I don't think. <laughs> this is like, what the fuck? Emma. There's something I haven't told you. What now? When the curse washes over us, it will send us all back. Nothing will be left behind, including your memories. It's just what the curse does. The storybook will no longer exist. It won't ever have existed. So these last years will be gone from both your memories. So then and how we'll do we know these stories again? What will happen to us? I don't know. It doesn't sound much like a happy ending. It's not. And I can't give you one. You can preserve our memories? No. I can do what I did to everyone else in this town and give you new ones. You cursed them and they were miserable. They didn't have to be. My gift to you is good memories, good life for you and Henry. You have never given him up. You have always been together. You would do that? When I stop Pan's curse and you cross that town line, you will have the life you always wanted. But it won't be real. Well, your past won't, but your future will. Now go. There isn't much time left. The curse will be here any minute. I don't know. Something's not passing the smell test. Just so you know, 
You can change your mind. Wait. Let me hold it. Then who's the dad? How did Neil... How did Neil... How did that all happen then? How did Neil go there? How did Neil leave? Because it's not related? A year later? From the birth? Or from... Um, I forgot something. Wait, cinnamon. Man, she's going to turn you in. And me, you know that I thought I looked out. A year? Someone coming up? No. Henry, wait here. This one. That last Do I know you? I need your help. Your family is in trouble. My family's right here. Who are you? No, friend. I know you can't remember me, but I can make you. Ah, right, cue oh. me! Oh. What the hell are you doing? A long shot. I was hoping you felt as I did. All you're gonna feel is the handcuffs when I call the cops. Look, I know this seems crazy, but you have to listen to me. You have to remember... Who was that? No idea. Someone must have left the door open downstairs. Come on, let's eat. I am just like mind fucked. I have no idea what the fuck just happened or how. <laughs> I'm just. That did not go how I thought it was going to go. We're, maybe everybody. Maybe this was all just a dream. Maybe everybody's just asleep. Maybe this is just somebody's imagination. Is Rumpel really dead? How did Hook come out and still remember? How? What? What? What is gonna happen now? I'm just like my mind. Like I, I got nothing. I'm just like. The last episode, I feel like, was, like, relatively chill. And this one, they were just kind of like, you know what? Fuck it. Fuck it all. We're going to blow it all up. What? You thought you you thought you thought we were going one way? You were, we were going to have this show be a certain way? And everybody was going to chill? And we were just going to continue this storyline? Nope. I don't even... I don't know. Let me know what y'all thought about this one, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.